Yo, man, I hope to God none of my fellas see me riding around this car, man. You really let this shit go bad. What you don't understand is I don't care how it looks. You ain't got no class, Jack. Class isn't something you buy. Look at you. You got a $500 suit on. You're still a low life. Yeah, but I look good. Because there's some fine fat my life. I've seen some... What's that chick? India Love? She got some fat fucking sisters, and her sisters are fine to me. They're very cute for some big overweight-ass girls. So there's some fat motherfuckers who can get it. Yeah, I got a gut. There's some good pussy under this gut. Well, it's not, I'm not shitting on the fat girls. There's some fat motherfuckers that I'll take to the prom if I was in high school. That's right. She got an anklet on and an anklet holding on for dear life. Like, ah! <laughs> Welcome back everyone, this is CKC Entertainment with some more Tariq Nasheed and the best of ISM Radio. Tariq Nasheed, Layla, and Bree, give it up and make this look easy. I'll be back to tell you how I think about it. Thank you so much for watching. Yes. How are you, Bree? How was your day? You said you had a rough day. What happened I had today? a rough two days. What happened, dear? You guys, I was in the shower and the building that I live in, they cut the entire building's water off. Damn. That stopped my entire process. Lord. Were oh you in mid-shower or yes. was... Oh, damn. So you didn't get to yes. wash, wash off your cash and prizes? No. <laughs> yes, I did. Oh, I baby wiped it so down. You, and you had the Aquafina your titties? Yes. <laughs> what? No doubt. We went and got bottles of water and made it happen. No. Rough days, guys. Hell Rough no. days. And, Yo, what up, Flex? This is Ernie from Detroit. Ernie from Detroit. How you doing? I ain't met a nigga named Ernie in a long fucking time. <laughs> nigga, you old school. You, you must be a junior. Ernest Jr., right? Nah, nah. Nope, uh, just Ernest. Uh, 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 I ain't met an Ernie in, since the 80s, nigga. Well, we're moving on now. We're moving on you must have old parents. What? They had you in their 50s or some shit. <laughs> Name of a motherfucker Ernest. <laughs> so, how do you guys feel about Ray Lewis, Neely? Oh, my God. Lord, Tariq. Tariq. Said, they called him. They called him. They called him opportunist. opportunist. <laughs> There's a lot of. He's an opportunist. There's a lot of opportunist. I said that he dropped a butter biscuit on the ground. That's what he was kneeling for. Right, nigga. On the rock, it's red, red. Ah, ah! Why are you doing, nigga? Stand up. <laughs> I fell out laughing on the floor. <laughs> and then needed help. Getting yes. down and getting up with your old ass. Yes, and that's the thing. We got to make these coons bow down, too. That's why we got to be on code to the point where the coons don't have a safe space no more. And I love that. The coons are getting on board. But don't, don't. <laughs> they are opportunists. These coons are looking to get back into the good graces. Yeah, I'm like, they get no slave. more before yeah. another reason. Yeah, so let's not. We used our coons for what they were. <laughs> Remember he said he would never kneel down because never. he oh, had his family fighting for the flag. Yeah, uh -huh. and exactly. Exactly. <laughs> and the white supremacists are mad at him. They're like, you disrespectful nigger. <laughs> you bum. They're like, they're getting on his ass, but that's good. We're doing things in unison. Yeah. Okay. And have you seen that motherfucker Wendy Williams in a bikini? I mean, do you blame the dude? I mean, she's a hot Aww, dick. Come on. Somebody <laughs> said she's shaped like a dick and balls. <laughs> <laughs> do y'all think this is karma? They, People are like, it's karma. Yeah. She's talking about everybody. Yeah, somebody said she's shaped like Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it's definitely karma. Oh my god! I mean, she can because she keep everybody shit going. Because I've been clowning her on Twitter because it not Twitter on Instagram because of them damn bikini pictures. <laughs> yeah, boy. Now, thank you. <laughs> Niggas calling up with personal information. <laughs> thank you. Hey, Bree, I was used to work at the plant with you. We we're making eight dollars an hour back in the day. <laughs> <laughs> putting your business. I oh, know. God he did damn. Put me on. He put me Don't put blast. people business out there. It's all yeah. good. I, I sold you a bag of weed <laughs> back in 97. <laughs> what? And I don't really know you. I just sold the weed to you. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, man. Then uh, Kylie's pregnant. We know that. We know Kylie's we pregnant. We also know that Tyga is trying to say he the daddy, too. Y'all heard about that? Tyga's trying yeah. to say he the daddy. They also saying she may be Kim's surrogate. And that she's Damn. pregnant with a girl. Oh, yeah, I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Says, yeah. I'm like, what trimester is this motherfucker in? They know all this shit. Mm -hmm. I mean, damn. <gasps> I didn't think about that because who is Kim? Who is carrying Kim's baby? No one knows. Mm. Her damn sister. And that, that I believe. I wow. believe because uh, Chloe was offering to carry the baby, but then it was like. <laughs> 
Damn. Uh, Can you have kids? And she Kendall's young too. She's a young body, you know, less complication. I just really don't think. She, I don't know. I, the the Kardashians seem too fucking shallow to offer. Her good body that she making all that money off of to have but Kim's baby. They so out there, it'll be damn Bruce Jenner as the surgeon. <laughs> I mean, you don't know what the fuck is going on with them. I swear. Shit. Hey, kids. It's time for Gary's vanity table. I swear, he'll be like the first dude. The first transsexual trans, yeah. surrogate. Stop it. Get some help. They yeah. can make it happen. If they anybody can. can make it happen, they can yeah, make it happen. Shit, you never know with them, man. Uh, that can make it happen for sure. My God. Mm -hmm. Let me see who else is on this phone. <laughs> I I am very silly. Um, I think I'm a little silly, much more silly than uh, Tariq Rashid. But um, I, I owe him a debt of gratitude for bringing me so much joy, and I hope I brought you some. Thank you for watching. You want some of this so you can live it up,